welcome friends in this video let's continue the paleolithic culture also called as old stone age culture the people in this period were practicing hunting and food, food gathering so they are called hunters and food gatherers okay so this paleolithic culture started during the pleistocene period of ice age okay in my pre previous video i had discussed about the geological time scale of the earth okay so the pleistocene period was discussed in that so this paleolithic culture started during the pleistocene period of earth's history okay so in this period uh, the people used the quartz stone for making stone tools so this is important from prelims point of view and this paleolithic culture can be divided into three important uh, uh, phases these phases are divided according to nature of stone tools used by the people and also climatic condition at that period okay so the location of the paleolithic culture uh, are hill slopes slopes of the hills because uh, abundant uh, stone tools were available on the slopes of the hills so uh, the paleolithic cultures thrived on the hill slopes okay and river valleys of the country and majorly this paleolithic culture is absent in the alluvial plains of indus and ganga so this is important point this may come in the prelims examination that absence of early paleolithic culture in the plains of indus and ganga okay so as i mentioned earlier the paleolithic culture uh, is divided into three phases that is lower phase middle and upper paleolithic culture so lower paleolithic culture uh, the time scale runs from 5 5 lakh to 50000 bc okay 500000 to 50000 bc and the features of this of this period include it occupies a greater part of the ice age of pleistocene so during the pleistocene later part of the pleistocene age ice age came into existence so this paleolithic culture um, happened during the greater part of the ice age where the earth was covered with almost ice okay in in the northern hemisphere so this paleolithic lower paleolithic Uh, culture people used hand axe cleaver and choppers as the stone stone tools and the uses of these stone tools are for digging chopping and skinning of the of the meat okay and the sites uh, sites uh, of the pal lower paleolithic culture are son valley in the punjab kashmir and thar desert belan valley amirpur in up narmada area bhimbetka in madhya pradesh and next is middle paleolithic culture middle paleolithic culture thrived during 50000 to 40000 bc and the stone tools include here flakes flakes of the stones uh, it shows the region variation from one part of of the country into other so the varieties of these flakes include blades pointers borers scrapers of the flakes so these are smaller when compared to the hand axe and cleavers and much refined okay and the sites of middle paleolithic culture includes narmada and south of tungabhadra and upper paleolithic culture the last phase is uh, in the time period of 40000 to 10000 bc okay and this is the last phase of ice age and it is less humid and warm when compared to other two phases of the paleolithic culture and the tools include blades burins um, and sites are in the karnataka maharashtra madhya pradesh southern up south bihar and <coughs> excuse me here use of rock shelters shot started in bhimpet kaf madhya pradesh we find beautiful rock paintings in bhimpet kaf madhya pradesh of the age of upper paleolithic and mesolithic age okay so these are the stone tools which are used uh, during the paleolithic period this is uh, used during uh, lower paleolithic period this is much cruder stone tool of hand axe and cleavers and this these stone tools were developed during the middle paleolithic period so and this is the upper paleolithic period so you can observe the consistent decrease in the size of the stone tools and also increase in the refinement and efficiency and accuracy of these stone tools okay so you can observe uh, the difference and these stone tools are microliths which were uh, which were developed during the mesolithic period and these are the natural pebbles Uh, from which uh, the stone tools were made okay quartz so these are the stone tools and this is these are the sites of paleolithic age and you can uh, you can you can observe uh, the sites here the circle mark represents the lower paleolithic triangle represents the middle and 
square represents the upper paralytic period. Okay, uh, if you want, you can pause and look at the sides here in detail. Uh, next is Mesolithic age. So we, we know that uh, Stone Age can be div is divided into Paleolithic, Mesolithic, and Neolithic age. So Mesolithic age is the transition period, transition period be between Old Stone Age and New Stone Age. Okay, it is a transition period, and here the climate becomes warm and dry when compared to the Paleolithic culture. We know that in Paleolithic age the it occupies the later part of the ice age so ice age stopped during the Pal after the completion of paleolithic age and during the mesolithic age the warm and dry climatic condition came into existence and humans moved to newer areas because of the congenial environment for the subsistence in other areas of the world okay and here the subsistence is uh, in hunting fishing and food gathering so these people are also called as hunters and herders. So Mesolithic age started during 9000 BC. And tools used are microliths. Micro means small, lith means stone, microliths, small stones. Okay. And these are much refined when compared to the Paleolithic stone tools. And the sites found in Rajasthan, Southern UP, Central and Eastern India. And Bagor in Rajasthan is also an important site with respect to Mesolithic age. And Adamgarh in Madhya Pradesh, Bagor in Rajasthan, these are the earliest evidence for the domestication of animals. Even though uh, domestication of animals and plants started in the Neolithic age, it started much before in, in these sites. So these are all the stone tools. Okay, stone tools of the Mesolithic age, these are called microliths. You can observe the shapes. These are much refined, much sharper, and much. It, it can be used uh, for hafting. Hafting. It, 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 these are mounted on, on on bones, and also wooden uh, wooden structures, and used uh, efficiently. Okay, so these microliths. And we also come in to know that uh, the prehist prehistoric art. Uh, were existent during the Paleolithic and Mesolithic age. So in Bhimpetka in Madhya Pradesh, it has cave paintings. Okay, a lot of caves were cave dwellings were found in the Bhimpetka of Madhya Pradesh. More than 500 painted rock shelters were were recorded, and in an area of as small as 10,000 square kilometer. Here, the paintings of birds, animals, and human beings are painted, and hunting scenes were also painted. Uh, probably uh, these hunting scenes were uh, were painted uh, before going for actual hunting as a ritual purpose okay so they initially kill the animals uh, in the painting and hoping that they will kill the animal in the real hunting scenario okay so another important thing is that during the mesolithic age and also uh, the depiction of birds and animals we find the absence of perching birds in those paintings this shows that uh, domestication of plants that is agriculture was not uh, was not present at that period because perching birds subsistent uh, uh, are subsistence on, uh, on on the food grains okay so these are all related to paleolithic culture thanks for watching please share these videos so that it, it can reach more people i cannot contact all the people uh, i need your help to reach more people uh, to make this initiative a success thanks for watching